Hello, my friends. I am Humberto Fernandez, and today I'm going to be talking about a subject that I get asked about a lot, and that is the direct financing. So let's start by saying that direct financing is a financial instrument for pre-sales, which opposed to a bank loan is a financing that you get directly from the developer during the construction time. And yes, it also means that by the time of the delivery, you must have paid the property in full. So point number one, unlike a bank loan, it does not have an interest rate. That means that you just have to take the value of the property and divide it according to your payment plan. And point number two, is that developers offer different plans for direct financing. And although they can be tweaked a little bit, they can work as guidelines as for what the developer is willing to accept. Point number three, and this is very important, is that the minimum down payment that developers are willing to take is 30%. So whenever you're planning to purchase a property on pre-sale, you need to keep in mind that 30%. Now, for instance, a typical direct financing plan is what we call 30-40-30, meaning 30% down payment, 40% throughout the construction time, and 30% at the end upon delivery of the unit. This is kind of the most basic direct financing plan that developers offer. And so the 30% down payment and the 30% at the end, they are pretty straightforward. But what about the 40% in between, you may ask? Well, those intermediate payments, they happen to be very flexible. I mean, you cannot avoid making intermediate payments. However, the amount and frequency, those are pretty negotiable. For instance, you can decide to make monthly payments or quarterly payments or even payments on specific dates. This really depends way more on your cash flow and it's just a matter of stating that in the offer. And now moving off from the typical 30, 40, 30 plan, there are some other payment structures that can come along with your investment plan. Let's say that you decide to make a 40% down payment, creating in this way a 40, 40, 20 uh, payment structure. And this actually would allow us to try to get a better discount with the developer. And so, and this is very important, as a general rule of thumb, increasing the amount of the down payment will allow you to get a better discount. And so just to put some numbers in an example, let's say that you're buying a property with a value of $100,000. You're buying it in January and the property is going to be delivered in December. So we already know that you will be giving a 30% down payment in January equivalent to $30,000. We also know that the final payment in December would be of another $30,000 equivalent again to a 30%. So the remaining 40% that is equivalent to $40,000, it can be just divided in equal payments, equal monthly payments that you would be doing from February till November of $4,000. And now there are some special cases that would fall into the category of promotions that developers may put out out every now and then just to make their products more attractive. Like for instance, you might find a developer that is offering a 30-70 payment plan as a promotion that is most likely limited to a number of units. This means a down payment of 30% in just paying the remaining 70% at the end. Now something important is that these promotions are usually limited to a number of units. Developers do this in order to kickstart the sales of their developments. So whenever you find a chance like this, you might want to consider it seriously. And also, so pursuant to the same goal that I stated before, a developer may very well launch a promotion taking a 20% or even a 10% down payment. Here I would say that the only remark is that you need to be aware that these are promotions and really is not something that you should expect unless it is offered to you. Because if you just come to a random developer and offer a 20 or a 10% down payment, most likely it is going to be rejected. And just a final remark before you go back to your amazing lives, Whenever you hear about a 0% down payment promotion, I would say that that reeks of a scam and you should be very cautious with those things. In my experience, whenever there's a 0% down payment promotion, something just doesn't work out. Either the developer doesn't have enough documentation or something always goes wrong. So really, really be aware of that. 0% down payment is just not realistic. And so my friends, I hope that this uh, little information was useful for you. And as always, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. If you have any other questions, don't forget to leave them down there in the comments and to the next one.